Hi you guys, welcome back to my channel. I just wanted to come here and do a quick video on how to bake without an ashy flashback. I see a lot of girls been doing it, but they still kind of look ashy to me. So I just want to, you know, put my little two cents in it and show you from a melanin perspective on how a dark, a dark skinned girl like myself bakes and look real bronze and goldy and you can't even see any type of flashback if I was to take a picture. So I'm gonna skim through my foundation routine that I normally do and once I start the baking and the powder process, I'll come back and explain to you exactly what I'm doing and why I'm doing it. Okay, this is NYC Smooth Skin Finishing Powder in Medium Beige. I like to use this because it's an off beige color. I'm not really into yellow setting powders like Ben Eye or Sasha Buttercup. They just scare me and I feel like beigey off white colors works best for my skin type and skin tone. So I like to use that. I'm taking my Wet Real Technique sponge and I'm dipping it into that powder. And the reason why I do that is because the sponge being wet helps um, push the product and melt the product into my concealer and foundation. So it just helps set it so much better than it being dry. After I let the powder bake on my face for a couple of minutes, I like to push the actual product that's left on my face into my skin so I can set my entire face. And I do that because I get really oily and that helps pre prevent my face from being oily. So as you can see at this point, I'm pretty ashy. I'm not my normal skin color. So um, that's not good. I like to go into my MAC Mineralize Skin Finish Powder in Deep Dark and I like to use that with a fluffy brush and warm my face up. And this stops you from looking ashy and this will stop you from having flashback. You just need to coat your face with that. And I also like to take my MAC Mineralize Skin Finish in Medium Deep and I like to put that under my eye as an under eye highlight. So in conjunction with taking any type of face powder, to you know warm up your face I like to go in with contouring and bronzing my skin and I like to use Anastasia Beverly Hills contour shades and carob cinnamon and espresso I also like to use max blush and format that is my secret ingredient to making myself look bronze and then I just like to highlight and that's about it um, I just hope that this helps some girls out there you don't necessarily have to use MAC Mineralize Skin Finishes, but you'll have to use something that's your skin tone, somewhat close to your skin tone. You'll have to neutralize those powders that's on your face, and then after that, spray your face down with some Fix Plus. And that's about it. So yeah, I just want to show you guys some close-ups of what it actually looks like. It's glowy skin. Um, and it's not ashy, so yeah, it works. Give it a try. Let me know. Bomb.